Hello and welcome to AutoCADs. So in this lecture, I have brought you a very quick tutorial on how to add up different GDNT symbols in your AutoCAD design. So AutoCAD does not provide you any particular library for GDNT symbols, but there's a trick that you can follow to add up those symbols. So for that, you just have to go for the multi-line text and then you have to place a multi-line text. Once the multi-line text is placed, the cursor will going to be popped up and this box will going to open, that is the text editor. In that you have to go for this insert tab and in that you have to go for the symbol and here you will not find the GDNT symbol so for that you just have to go for this other section and in other a new dialog box will going to open and from here you have to press the G button to get inside the G section and in that you will have a GDT font so just click on this GDT font and all the GDNT, GDNT symbol will going to be available select the symbol that you want to put like let's say that i want to put up the flatness over here so i'm going to double click over this flatness and it will going to be copied in this section from here you just have to press the copy button and it is it will going to be copied in your clipboard then just switch off this character map option and then just press the Control plus v button to paste it and it will going to be placed on your screen click on anywhere and this is how you can just put up the gdnt symbol if you want to make it bigger, you can just use a scale to enlarge it. Like I'm going to select a scale, uh, select a scale, and I can just scale up with any value that I want. So I hope that this tutorial will going to help you and subscribe for the updates like this. Thank you and catch up you in the next one.